up guys this is vlog number two we're back at CrossFit autumn and uh, today it's Thursday and that for me means uh, bodybuilding day uh, so no uh, um, no uh, heavy lifting or it will be heavy lifting but no no weight lifting um, and no metcons for CrossFit uh, so only bodybuilding and I will hit uh, back and chest yeah back and chest and I will start with doing deadlifts and I got Wendy here with me doing doing, so, doing some stretching and foam rolling um, yeah so and you guys will uh, be with me today uh, and I will yeah I will do uh, my goal today is to do six reps uh, at 200 kilos in deadlifts uh, so I'll, I'm looking forward to that it will be a PR for me and uh, maybe Wendy will come along and do some deadlifts as well uh, we'll see we'll see Uh, something I drink always uh, during my warm-up uh, before training is BCAs this is um, one scoop of uh, BCAs and uh, that's some, something I recommend everyone to do uh, I will go through the benefits of it in a, another video uh, but for now uh, look it up you can see that there's plenty of information in the in the internet so look it up and uh, yeah start with it uh, when you guys doing some uh, heavy deadlifts it's very important not to go uh, not to do too many reps uh, with light weight uh, or even when you get a little bit bit of higher uh, weight because uh, you don't want to burn out before the real set uh, so my, my goal is like I said before is to do six six repetitions with 200 kilos today uh, so I think I'll do three, three, uh, three reps on uh, on every weight until I get to like one one eighty, I think. So I will go uh, 100, 140, 160, uh, 180, and do three reps on all of them, and then last rep on on last set on um, 200, 200. I'll, I'll do all six of them. Uh, so it's very important that you plan your your workout uh, before so you don't like stuck in the middle of your workout and thinking how to do with the weights and stuff like that so now I got six um, six um, sorry 60 kilos down and I think I'll do like a for a warm-up eight reps will be good All right, 100 kilos on the bar. I will do uh, three reps, and one hundred one. Uh, I will do uh, three reps, <laughs> and another thing is that uh, do it with right form, right technique. Uh, when you go, when you when you increase weight, it's super easy to start lifting wrong. Uh, I will make a deadlift video as well, how to deadlift with right form. And uh, I can't make it today because I'm training, and I'm on all my focus on the on my lifts. Um, but uh, be careful. As you see, I'm not using any uh, belt or any straps right now. I always uh, do as much as I can without any anything so but when I feel like I okay now I need straps now I need belt I put it on uh, during the during the session all right 140 let's go all right uh, 180 on the bar um, 
I think I'll do it without any straps or belt I will do it with hook grip uh, and I will I will use some chalk with chalk you get better better grip on the bar uh, so that's the only thing I will do uh, I know I I, um, I increase weight uh, very fast 20 kilos but if, because I feel very comfortable with the weights and uh, and I, I've done a good warm-up uh, so but I don't recommend this th this type of uh, increasing the weight if you don't feel 100% uh, I feel quite good right now uh, I know this 180 will be uh, will be easy so uh, yeah be com confident and go all in One eighty felt good, uh, but for the, for the next next set of two hundred kilos, I think I'll use belt, but no straps. We'll see how it goes. That went good. Eight reps, 200 kilos. Oh shit, I'm dead. Tack man. Jag tror det. Men jag tycker det räcker där. Jag sa sex och gjorde åtta. Att du bara god mat på ämnet. Tack, tack. He said, eat some good food and then go home. You're done for the day. I'm done here. I wasn't supposed to. I wasn't supposed to do go heavy today. But it felt good. Sometimes just go with it. Um, now I'm just gonna superset chest with back. So I think I'll start with dumbbell press, superset with pull ups. I think close grip. Let's go. All right, um, I will start with the dumbbell, dumbbell incline press. I will do five reps because I want to uh, increase my strength and not my uh, not my uh, not muscle volume. Uh, so that's why that's why I don't do so many reps. Um, and I will do pull-ups over over there, and I will do 12 reps because there I, I want to build muscle. Uh, and strength as well all right let's go starting light with the uh, 27 kilos the one thing or it's several things you need to think about but the one that I see people do wrong is the range of motion they don't go all the way down or all the way up um, it depends on really what your focuses are and how uh, how into bodybuilding you are but if you are a beginner I would recommend go all the way down touch your chest and then go all the way up and lock your elbows Alright, 40 kilos and this should be heavy.
this was third set and I felt like I got really tired uh, and I feel like I won't be able to do 12 reps uh, uh, unbroken so what I will do is I will do six reps rest for about three seconds and do six reps again uh, and when you when you do this type of uh, split don't rest longer than 10 seconds uh, because if you do then you start another set Okay, um, if you feel like the pull-ups is too hard and you can't do them even if you split them up then I re recommend pull-downs instead and you can see Pindip here doing them very good um, have your back as straight as possible pull with your elbows here not with your hands and go all the way down Perfect. All right, done with the first part. Here with Pajandip. When you, what you're gonna do now? I don't really know. All right, we'll see. Uh, I think I'm going to do uh, cable flies. <laughs> cable flies over here. Uh, superset with uh, a back back exercise. I don't know yet what to do. Uh, I'm not sure because I've done deadlifts already. So it will be a little thing. Alright, we are done with today's workout. Uh, what did you think about today? Good pump session. Yeah, it was a recovery day for both me and Pindip. Uh, I wasn't supposed to go so heavy, uh, but I'm still happy that I did because I did a PR. 8 reps, 200 kilos. Uh, Pindip got a nice pump. Now she's eating her uh, uh, post-workout snatch. Uh, post-workout snack. Nah. Yeah, thank English. you. Yeah, sorry. All right. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, uh, and let me know what you what your thought saw thoughts thoughts is. Um, I feel like an English teacher. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> I'm getting better. At least I'm getting better. Um, Thank you, thank you. Um, another thing, uh, I really appreciate your feedback. I really want to know what you guys think because the only reason why I do this is to uh, for you guys to have someone to uh, uh, to learn from, from my experience, from my mistakes, uh, and I don't want you guys to do the same mistakes as as I did. Uh, so that's why I'm um, I talk much during the workout uh, and that's it's the same way I do with my clients um, you know, on each and every set um, I, I, I give them explanations why why I let them do what they do and and how can how they can get better and what mistakes uh, people usually do so you need to get the all around picture not only the the workout so you need to know how to do it wrong and how to do it right uh, so please leave a comment um, tell me what you think tell me what you want to see more about and I will do my best to uh, make it happen and thank you guys for watching uh, and you know the deal like and subs subs and subscribe thank you good